Hello YouTube, welcome to another uh, Roblox tutorial. Also if you have uh, any other questions, I also am making other tutorials or I have a couple other ones uh, uploaded as well. So in this tutorial I'll teach you how to make a basic building on Roblox. And here's a couple mesh kits that I built. And this is at my big huge personal server by the way. Where all my friends and builders and everybody alike gets together and starts building. And I give everybody base plates and I had a huge update so the server is about twice as big. So this is my base plate here. I give myself a lot of space because I build a lot. Alright, anyway, so let's get started. You can also do this on studio. And it's probably easier in studio. So let's use this build. You can also search these models up. So first we want to make a floor. Let's just say, well let's make a small building so it's going to be nice and simple. And this is just going to be basics. So first you want to make a floor. And I have other good building techniques as well. So, now we have our floor. Let's make it up about three blocks tall. And now next we want to do is add stairs. We want to make sure this is symmetrical. So let's uh, put that up all the way, and let's count by five or tens: one, two, forty, thirty, forty-five, fifteen. Oops, I did that wrong. Oh, it's okay now. All right. So that first step, we want to make it up to the house. You can make all kinds of stair designs if you want to. There's even glass transparent stairs you can make if you want to, which are really cool. Which I'll show you in a minute. So let's make some basic stairs. You just want to make a bunch of them and then start resizing them. Alright, so now we have stairs. Next we want to add uh, some like uh, siding to the bottom floor. So let's take a plate and do that real quick. Oh yeah, I also forgot we should add corners to the building. So let's take this. You want to use all symmetrical parts, by the way. That's the best. So let's put that in the corner. Yep, that's in the corner. And see, frame that down. There we are, we have a corner. Now this makes the edges really... It makes them look nice. See, frame. Put that down. And if you want, you can see frame it like point uh, one hundredth of a uh, of a stud down if you want to, because you will see some little frame tearing right here if you can see that. Now we have one more. All right, I gotta do this quickly because I only got ten minutes of this recording device. I'm gonna try to get a new one soon. And it's gonna be way better. I promise you guys, it's getting action. I think it's like three times better than this. Get better frame rates. I'll upload you videos faster and it also gives me higher quality. On Roblox though, it it's kind of a little bit glitchy for some reason. I don't know why it does that. But it still uploads in great quality. So anyway, let's get this on. Alright, so now we have our siding. Our building looks really nice already. And now the next step is to add walls. And now you can do any technique that you want to, but this is what I recommend. So first we want to make a basic wall. Let's take another symmetric block. One by one by one. Symmetrical. Um, let's make a door frame first. Let's make that eight blocks high. Actually let's make it nine. So it's just gotta be a block on top of it. It's gonna be ten total. See so frame this down. And if you want to make this destructible, you can make it unanchored, and then you can weld it together, whatever you want. And then let's make some walls. Um, let's make it too high. The number two. Nice and symmetrical. Add one on each side. 
It's turning nighttime, by the way. There. Now we have our walls. Now we want to add some windows. So let's add the roof first. Which we can do that pretty easily, even though we don't have those blocks on the ground. Or the top portion of the wall. Actually, you know what? Easier way to do this. We gotta add some quarter frames. Now you gotta make sure they're symmetrical to the level of the roof you want to be. I'm gonna do this fairly quickly. And then you want to add uh, some windows. So I'll stop the video real quick and then I'll pause and come back later and show you what's made. And now since we have a frame up, now we're going to add windows. So we can take these little poles here and then evenly place them. So let's go by, let's say, fives. Five over here. And you know, I just keep doing that, and you can make your own window designs as well. So I'll pause the video again. You can make whatever video, I mean, sorry, uh, window designs that you want to. Let's go five, six, seven, eight over here. And you want to make sure these are all symmetrical, otherwise, your windows are going to look pretty messed up. So, window frames right there. Also, going to add another portion. Wait, let's not do that actually. Alright, pause the video again. And then I'll be back soon and add some windows. Alright, so now that we added our window frame design, it's time to make uh, our roof. So basically, we can just add a roof just like that. Just copy the floor. And it should work out. Whoops. Don't do that. Okay, so you just add on a layer like that. Actually, you know what? Let's C frame this down one. So you don't get that kind of overlapping look on the top so this roof looks like it's kind of inside the building now see it looks much better alright so this roof is fairly tall and so to make a better looking roof let's take a symmetric wedge and basically just go on from there let's make this 15 Raise it by, let's see, three. It's not that big of a building. And there we are. And then we take a block and just fill it in with the wedges at the same height. There we are. Now we have our building. Now, how to add windows. The best way to add windows is to use a um, plate, if I can see frame this correctly. Make it 0 by 8, 0 0.8. And now, we must use a transparency tool, or you can do this in um, Studio Under Properties. Let's make this 0 0.5, counting by 5. Whites. You can make the color of the windows anything you want. Put it in like that. C frame at one point a tenth of the way, and this will save you. Uh, it l not only does it look better, but it also causes less lag because you're only using like like couple panels, so it works better as well. So let's put that in. There's only f 50 seconds left, so I'll pause the video real quick and then I'll do my end. So now I put in the windows and this building actually looks pretty good. I might make this a store. So thanks for watching and I'll make a second part of the video on how to make uh, uh, buildings more detailed, how to add flooring designs and how to add lights and stuff like that. I'm not a very good furniture builder but I'll try to. And so here's a store. Gives you some uh, flooring design kind of things. And you can just use like tiles or whatever. and whatever you want basically so that'll be it for the tutorial uh, like subscribe share this and happy holidays and comment and ask any questions and see ya have a good day or night